Hello, I'm Felicia Yap, saying hello from Hyde Park in London. I'm really excited about my debut thriller yesterday, which will be released in America on the 1st of August. Um, it's really about a murder that takes place in a world where most people only remember yesterday. Now, a dead woman's body is found in a river um, and suspicion falls on the man she had been sleeping with and his wife. But how do you solve a murder when all who are involved have limited memories, including that of the detective investigating the case? Now, I wrote this book because I wanted it to hold up a mirror to ourselves, to what we choose to remember um, and what we choose to forget. And connected with this, I feel, is our own capacity for self-delusion. Because memories transform over time, they change. And studies suggest that 80% of what we remember isn't actually what happened. So this book really um, is about how we ourselves make memories um, and how um, the slippery nature of memory is actually very relevant to us all. At the same time, I also wanted to look at technology because um, studies suggest too that Google searches, uh, Wikipedia in entries are making it much more difficult for us um, to remember things without the aid of the computer. Um, but is the information on these devices true? Um, what's fact? What's fake? Um, are our memories merely the lies we choose to tell ourselves or the past we prefer? Now, I've just realized that, you know, from writing about a, memory, a book about memory is that people just remember the last thing an author says. So I'll finish with this. Yesterday is a story about the lies we choose to tell ourselves masquerading as memories. Because if we can only remember yesterday, suppressed secrets and old wounds take on chilling new meaning, especially if it involves murder. I really hope that yesterday is a thriller you won't forget.